Hi and welcome to the freelance channel. My name is Florante and today's video I'm going to show you how to turn on two-factor authentication on your iPad. Now if you've seen some of the videos that I've created previously I've been setting up two-step verification for Gmail or Google Apps email accounts but today I'm going to help you out to set up another security feature this time on your device on your iPad or on your iOS devices and this is called two-factor authentication as compared with Google they make use of two-step verification although the concept is similar they just actually had this name uh, change it's basically the same thing so this is another layer of protection for you. I know that iOS devices are generally safer, generally uh, more secure than most devices, but it's always a good practice to make sure that you have another layer of protection. Just to, you know, it's not being paranoid, it's just being wise since this one is available this feature is available then let's go ahead and take advantage of this it's after all it's for our own good alright so if you have your iPad or your iPhone ready let's go ahead and get started now first thing that you need to do is to go to the settings so just tap on the settings and if it takes you into the general window or the general view go ahead and scroll down and look for the iCloud that's what we're going to open that's where we will need to go to and then once you're on the iCloud view or the iCloud window tap on your avatar this will help us access the password and security option for your device and then let's go ahead and tap on password and security and from here you will see right away that two-factor authentication is currently turned off so what we're going to do we'll go ahead and tap on turn on two-factor authentication and there's some information right there or if you would like to learn more about two-factor authentication and the security feature you can go ahead and tap on learn more if not let's go ahead and tap on continue so right here it's going to require you with a phone number so that you can be sent a text message or they can make a phone call to your device to verify the identity of the one who's trying to log into the account so the same process just go ahead and change the country if you're not from the US choose the country where you're residing or where your mobile phone is registered so for me I'll go ahead and choose okay since I'm from the Philippines I'll go and look for plus six three there you go and I'll type my number and I'll keep the check sign on text message I prefer to receive a text message instead of a phone call so I'll go ahead and choose that one now the next thing is to tap on next alright so I believe from here we'll receive an SMS where okay there you go so I've received the SMS message and this one says your Apple ID verification code is let me go ahead and type it there that's three four seven four four one okay so the phone number is now verified I'll just go ahead and I'll need to log in using my password okay it's verifying okay there you go so right now we already have the two-factor authentication turned on 
So that's how simple and how easy it is for you to turn on your two-factor authentication. Okay, now you will also notice that on this window, you will see that there is this trusted phone number. Now, if you have another or if you have an alternate phone number, you can still go ahead and tap on add a trusted phone number. And that way, if you lose one of your phones, you can still have another backup. So that's it for today's video, for today's tutorial. Thank you so much for watching. And if you have any questions, you can drop your questions in the comments box. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please don't forget to click on subscribe. Once again, my name is Florante. Thank you so much for your time and I hope to see you in the next video.